Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Koji Sheldon. The head is big for a reason. I they come rant. And I they come rant about, you know, what is basically in our newsfeed and various entertainment pundits are talking about it. How Ghanaian artists go fit, organize successful shows, you know, outside the borders of the country. We are looking at, you know, the UK, the US, and, you know, all the, all the other countries out there. You know, and when the successful year, they mean, say, the O2. And since Ashake go through the O2, you know, hit come day Ghanaian artists, them are top. Like, then they catch hit past China phone, way in battery die, way then they overcharge, and we hit the hit. And I understand. So the conversation day, new developments come from the camp of the artists, the various artists. Yesterday, in a video, you could see that Famiya was like visibly angry, visibly frustrated, because according to him, and once again, these are not my words, according to Famiya, when Ghanaian artists put up shows in, let's say, the US, the UK, the Belgium, the Amsterdam, and whatnot now, the Ghanaian community you know they support them. They know they pull up to attend some of these shows. But they will do for Nigerian artists. Once again, these are not my words. These are the words of Famiye. Since I blew up 2019, my boss to America, my boy Canada, Germany, mm. I, I go with other artists too. I'm fine, mama. When you say I'm fine, my you. So we won't say two and you know, there's a gun of food made in. And who put no more ferry, so they don't even come. Oh, how? Why are people outside there? Why do Ghanaian artists keep uh, cancelling their shows? Mm -hmm. They don't come. Hmm. Whiskey, they bash you. Four months time, what could be some permission? Mm -hmm. I would you maybe say on this day? I want to go, yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yes, I'm my Peter. Yeah, yes, I'm my way. Yeah, yeah. And you people have witnessed in New York. I don't want to mention names. Big, big names for here, just last year. Mm -hmm. They had a concert, yeah. small place. Sisi, say ni pa ten ba ya Even 10 people didn't show. Me body na, you be surprised. Body ne? That be, and ko ye. Me, I me, me, I will say, because me, I had my show in UK, like last week. I yeah. was expecting a lot of people. Fe mm. It is few way come. Mm. Like how many people? I know we'll is it the promotion that didn't work? Pro or is it a song that people mm. are not vibing to? Or they just don't want to support? Our people mm. are don't people know. Are... All of a sudden, I said, Inten intentional, it just, because it wasn't like that before. Mm. Because that was why Nigerians were featuring Ghanaian artists. Yeah. Those times, Ben Abbey featured Wale, Sack or the uh, uh, Flavor of Abbey featured uh, Sack. Yeah. No, right now, we will chase them to feature them. They don't want, because, I don't know if the mileage been or if it's been on this side. That's a problem then. Yes, and we now go do one. So Famia was like, you could see that your man was frustrated. And I understand. Then when the share two tweeted, why is feeling O2 and winning Grammy? Why have they become the standard to measure the success of an artist? But Mali and Tupac are successful musicians, but never won a Grammy. Let Ghanaian musicians breathe. Ghana, wake up. Like if you know, if you know how the Ghana wake up, cry me and go Adam. So that is the conversation on various social platforms. So with Famiya's video, Famiya was basically saying, he said, when they organize shows outside the country, Ghanaian artists, when they organize shows outside the country, the Ghanaian communities know they pull up. See, I understand where he's coming from, but I they, I they disagree on some levels too. Now the Ghanaian community, them day there, no, bro, she, me so, I'm a bo, bo Juma, eh, Sunday to Sunday. Oh. You understand? So if you they try organize show and you not tap into holidays and days where people that my schedules be flexible, where they go feel pop up, they go feel show up, unless you call your family members. Also, awareness creation about shows. I have seen instances where artists are supposed to go perform outside the country, and of course. You are supposed to collaborate with the event organizers. More, more times, maybe the event organizers where they put the artists on. You the art, unless the artist now you now you get your logistics and things where you feel like you can create your own original show. That is fine. But most, mostly, you know, it be the event organizers where they plug the artists. So if any two by four event organizer can't tap you, say, I go, I, I won't put you in this market. No research done, no publicity work, nothing. 
Then you follow them. Then on the day of the event, you have 10 people in the auditorium. Please, don't come to me complaining. As I said, I've seen instances where artists are supposed to perform, let's say in the US. You go to their pages and the shows, the, like the show where they go perform on, you, they have not even posted any artwork to even highlight that, oh, this, I will be here. No videos are done. Nothing. On the day of the event, who do you expect to come out there? Also, you need to understand that dissemination of information in the Ghanaian community be paramount. So what do you do? You find the people that would communicate, that will re rehash, that will highlight, that will let them know that this is what is happening. You understand? So if we don't do all these things, then you feel like because you have one hit song in a country, you can go outside the country. Nah, bro, it doesn't work like that. If they take, that is why some of these big, big artists, like the video, the West Case and things, if they go do, let's say, the O2 Arena, then they, if they go do one in December, you know, when they, they go tweet, uh, take it to the link in January. Then the organizers go start to do the groundwork, the promotion, the publicity, the interviews, the videos, the influencer plugs and turns. This will enable them or this will enable people. This will trigger some form of emotions or it will trigger people to say, oh, this is what is going to happen. So let's go and purchase a ticket. If you don't do that, don't expect now, bro. First of all, nobody owes you anything. That sense of entitlement like, oh, I am from Ghana. No. If, if, Ghanaians, if, the, if the Ghanaian community in the diaspora, decide to come to your concert. That is beautiful. If they don't come, you can't do them. You don't go to do them anything. Or you can't do them anything. If be then, then get them my dollars, them my pounds, and them my euros. So I feel like we have to do more. And whether you like it or not, make, they, when they share tweet, make you not do like you know be bro. Artists with them day out there, it be your aspiration. It be something where if you achieve it, it will be you say you go go sell out the O2. No Ghanaian artist go tell me say if you go out there where you sell the O2, you no go be him, or you no go put for his CV top. It go be you. It go be one of the achievements, or even the that like it go be achievement where you go be proud of. So make you not look like. Winning a Grammy, you no know, be validation. Feeling O2, you know, you know they need any valid. Bro, if you do it, it will be you. Also, we should concentrate. I feel like maybe we are concentrate. We are, we are building conversation around Phil, Phil, Phil. Maybe we should build the audience too. We need to build the audience because it is the audience that are going to fill the auditorium, right? Build the audience home and abroad. Build it. Even if you have 200 people, dedicated audience, build a dedicated audience. People that, that are willing to purchase a ticket for 20 pounds, $20 to come see you. When you build it with the products that you have and you have a dedicated audience and let's say you need, um, let's say, 100 people to fill a very small auditorium, bro, if they fuck with your content, they will come. So groundwork, groundwork, bro. Me say the fact say you you, you get you get one hit song no means you go feel or the two you go feel O two. No, you know they work like that. And Famia said in the video, say you know one mention him. There are big artists in this country where they go to the U S. There they say they go do concert. Eleven people self no show up. These are not my words. These are not my words. Famia, he talk. Say 11 people self no show up. They had to cancel it. You know go we'll cancel. You go cancel. So the groundwork, build a dedicated audience, plugging, tapping. But make you people not make you look like, oh, you be like feeling old to know be anything. And I, bro, it be something whether you like it or not. And as the Nigerians, they do know. Ah, I mean, you people, your, your, a, uh, Konimo. Konimo no go de a uh, Twitter space top the talk say uh, what a shake do any none of one artists go do a whole lot of things. It be you people. You wish say it be you, you dead there. So make you know, make it look like you know they need it. If they need how to get there be the problem. 
and we should put in the work, bro. It be work, oh. Yesterday, I saw the video that I see. And that issue, and Famia even cited an example where he showed in London, he, he, he wasn't impressed with the attendance. He now said it in a video. He said, he showed in London, and I was there. The attendance was terrible. Appalling. So, media, I carry a media, I say what I, me, I'm going to sit here and say it. By the end of the day, it is every artist's dream to do this, to do these numbers. And whether you like it or not, it will come back to bite you. So make, bro, I mean, I don't believe, so you don't need any validation. You didn't need them. And as an artist, if you get them where you attach them, it didn't make sense. So maybe it's a step for us to go back to the drawing board. We need to, hey, what, what sound are we even, with the sound? We go identify, say, this be the sound we they take, go fill these auditoriums. Which sound? Ghana, what is your sound? High life, no, no, I'm going to say beans. High life, they say make you no do. Uh, people say high, high life will be attractive. Uh, the Ghanaian drill tour. Look at what um, Asaka boys are doing with the Ghanaian drill. Do you know what we can, we go feel do? Do you know the kind of like spaces they go feel filled with the right backings and the resources? But you watch it, watch and see. You say Miss Ghana party in the park. There were a lot of Ghanaians there, about ten thousand people. And it wasn't a free event. It was a ticketed event. So where did they come from? If you market your show well to the Ghanaian audience in the diaspora, they will show up. They will show up. They don't owe you anything. They don't owe you any concert attendance. They don't owe you any tickets buying. But I feel like if they want to, they, they, then they do them. So I could not do uh, O2 Indigo before. It do them. Shatawale self do O2 Indigo before. And I think that one will be like 2000 or something. Bro, maybe right now, be, 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 we need to be serious. You don't even have a pro What is your product? So, maybe I don't think this is on the Ghanaian art. Uh, this is on the Ghanaian audience in the diaspora or anything. Even if there is a problem, if it is on, bro, it, we don't have to point accusing fingers. This we this is like a holistic effort to tackle this. We should just come together and see how we go do one. Because once again, if we come sit, uh, uh, if if familiar go away, go for auditorium. I will come sit here and blast it. Stoneboy, look at what Stoneboy is doing. There was a video where Stoneboy was performing at a museum. That wasn't even a concert. And you know, say it'd be like for limited people, like, you know, it'd be like intimate kind of concert or performance. So a lot of people for not be there. Where video pop up, people start to make jokes about it. Hey, Stoneboy go perform to three people. God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. That is what they were. These are not my words. You see the Asaka thing. You see the way everybody is posting. Asaka go fill auditorium. They are coming to the city near you. You think that no go encourage people to make them go buy a ticket. But if them go, where well, we can't sit here talk, say, show not flop here. I'm going to call Antwerp. Who, if, who for Antwerp if, if I come go the concert? I say, I'm going to you come show you. I say, I flop you. I'm not going to buy a ticket. So word of mouth. Positive word of mouth recommendation. So we are all part. This is not a time to point accusing fingers. This is not a time to... Tweet said, oh, we let Ghanaian, we will not let you people breathe. Mm -hmm. We will not let you breathe because we feel like you people will do more. Yes, as I did here, they talk about Ghanaian concerts in the diaspora. And yes, uh, a beautiful concert, they come happen. Now, yeah, Quartunium, Eddie Ashe, Uchedi, and Porto Tribune, Sukami, I want to swing with Assassin's Week, we are going to meet you, Bruno, Eddie Ashe, and Eddie Nunyam. Yes, the Zama Gospel Explosion is happening. And bro, it is happening on the what? 21st of October, 2023, 5 p.m. to 10 p.m. And you see the beautiful thing about they have assembled the Avengers for this particular gospel explosion. Make I mention them. We have Selena Baden. We have Duny from Nigeria. Ministre no, Ministre no, young, oh, Apostle Henry Ampoma Boatin. He's not coming there alone. He's bringing Lady Reverend Perpetua Ampoma Boatin. Then what? We have Lydia Cabs. Now, oh, Akase Brimpong. Akese Brimpong too is going to be part of this explosion. So you can't afford to miss it. Now the tickets, no. Early bed, yeah, 10 pounds. Yes, early bed will catch early when. Then standard, yeah, um, 20 pounds. And a VIP, yeah, 30 pounds. Oh, yes. If you, they won't buy tickets, uh, the tickets be available in all the Ghanaian shops in Nottingham. And uh, 
um, the bar shops too. If you go there, you go fit, get some. Then make sure say you go you, you for buy them, then prepare because oh twenty first October ne oh things go happen. What do you say? Location no, or venue near Albert Hall Conference Center, Nottingham. Albert Hall Conference Center, Nottingham. <laughs> Bro, young as I'm UK visa and no honumiti. If you see me do yeah, that was you. Don't be surprised because we have to die and see because I mean look at this head. Look at the way he has blessed this, this head. Bro, be part of the Zama Gospel Explosion. Follow them on Instagram for more details. I will drop the link. The link to purchase ticket. Let me say ticket. The link to purchase ticket in the description, in the comment section, and the uh, description. Now, Yanko Yenim. Dingo this.